Hey everyone, today we're diving into the incredible world of overnight shipping. You won't believe the logistics behind this astonishing feat that takes place every single night. So strap yourself in and let's get started. Overnight shipping is an amazing achievement in the world of logistics if you stop to think about it. While it might not be the cheapest option, the fact it works is mind-blowing. That you can send a package from San Francisco on a Monday night and have it arrive in London, UK by Tuesday. And that's with the time difference taking a chunk out of that. Or ship from Dublin, Ireland on a Tuesday and get it in Anchorage, Alaska by 9 a.m. on Wednesday. The three major courier companies making all this happen are FedEx, DHL, and UPS. Not many people realize this, but FedEx boasts more planes than Emirates, Etihad, and Qatar Airways combined. DHL delivers to every country in the world, even North Korea. And UPS flies to more destinations than the largest passenger airline. What's the secret behind their super-fast deliveries? It's their massive global networks that allow for lightning-fast shipping at relatively low prices. Each of these giants operates hundreds of flights nightly, but FedEx takes the cake as the largest cargo airline in the world. And speaking of FedEx, they have a web of hub airports all over the world. But the most crucial one is in Memphis, Tennessee. Why, you ask? It's not as if it's the geographic center of the U.S. Well, it is central enough. And it's all about reaching the most amount of people in the shortest time. UPS has its global hub in Louisville, Kentucky. And the scale of their operations in these relatively small cities is staggering. The difference in size between the commercial terminals and the hubs themselves is a real indicator. And to ensure even small towns receive their packages by 9 a.m., FedEx runs flights in small propeller aircraft from the destinations of their larger jets. It's like a mini hub system that keeps everything running smoothly. Not every FedEx package goes through Memphis. That would be inefficient. They have secondary hubs like Oakland for more efficient routing, ensuring packages don't take unnecessary detours. Now, here's something that really surprised me. FedEx's hub in Anchorage, Alaska is home to the fourth busiest cargo airport globally. This is because of its strategic location as a stopover point for flights from the U.S. to Asia. FedEx and UPS use this stop for sorting, not just refueling. The magic happens during sorting, where packages from Asia are processed and sorted to be put on the plane bound closest to their destination. This cuts down on shipping time and cost, which is crucial in the highly price-sensitive shipping industry. Commercial airlines regularly fly their planes for more than 12 hours a day, while FedEx's planes wait around a lot. They use old aircraft at the end of their lives, like the Airbus A300s to keep costs low. Amazon, the behemoth in the world of e-commerce, is shaking things up by getting into the delivery business. With more than a million packages shipped daily, they've built their logistics network and a fleet of 86 aircraft currently. Amazon's scale allows them to cut out the middleman and save big. Who knows what the future of overnight logistics will look like with them getting in on the action. However, FedEx, UPS, and DHL won't get left behind. They are continuously working on enhancing the efficiency of their networks. As the adage states, time really is money when it comes to global logistics. So there you have it, the incredible world of overnight shipping. Well, that's it for today. If you liked the video, hit the like button and subscribe and we'll see you soon for more.